I'm gonna watch the Quiet Place part two. Now, Quiet Place part one had me so scared and so silent and so paranoid and so stressed out that I couldn't use the restroom for like three or four days after I saw the movie. This movie, I was like, how can they up the ante? How can they have me stressed? I've never paid attention to high sound to pick up an orange. I've never paid attention to high sound to pick up a plastic bag. I've never paid attention to high sound to walk down the street. And now that I know how it's how to do all those things, I will never, ever, ever take it for granted. Let's get into the movie. The movie picks up where the last movie left off, but it's shows flashback scene how the whole thing started these aliens walk through fire these things walk through fire 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 the stress level in this movie if the doctor tell you you got to take blood pressure medication fellas if you are having troubles keeping it up i promise you a quiet place part two is like visual viagra you will have no problem blood will flow to every part of your body at the fastest highest rate i've ever seen in my life and the movie gives you no break you know how scary movies thriller movies intense movies gives you like six seven minutes of just no this movie don't let you breathe it's like being baptized over and over and over again and not being able to come up for air. If you come up for air, you dead wrong. You got to be baptized again. This movie is like being in the elevator, having a fart, and you on the first floor, but you got to go to the 19th floor, and you holding it in, and that elevator is packed full of pretty people, and you don't want to be that person. If you ever been walking through your house and you hit your foot on the corner of the bed or the corner of the kitchen or the corner of the dresser, and you pause for like two seconds, and you hold your breath because you know that pain's going to come, and then you just got to anticipate. Now, multiply that feeling by an hour and 36 hours. I went 40 minutes of straight just and the mama is so damn strong, man. I want a woman like that. I know she married to John Kowinski, but Kowinski, Jim from the office. I know he probably a great husband. I know he probably hold her face by her chin and kiss her in her mouth. But sir, you got a great wife. If she's anything like she is in this movie, you better not never leave her. If she want peanut butter and jelly, you better give it to her. Train scene. Oh my God, the train scene when the little girl who was devils on the train scene by herself trying to be Wonder Woman. That happened. Oh my gosh, the boat scene, the boat scene when that man jumped in that water. Then he looked back at it and you was like, you a damn Live, you telling me ET can swim too? Oh my gosh, when they go to Gilligan Island and they go over there and did you mind, did you mind? You know, the big chocolate man with that nice ass face where he looked mean and stuff, but you like, is he gonna die? I don't know if he gonna die, but he drove that car like he need to be in the Fast and Furious part 10. Even the little baby that, oh, he do the whole movie. All of them need Oscars, all of them need Nickelodeon Awards, all of them need CBS Awards. Give them scratch out tickets and guarantee them winners. Dog, they act so good. The passion, the pain that that mother, that those children. And then I don't even know the man act name in real life. The male actor, the main actor in the whole movie, him right there, him. Everything about him was just heroic and he didn't even know it. I bet he smelt like outside the whole movie, but damn it, who cares, dog? You want to talk about how to get your kids to love each other? If your kids have a problem and they argue and they fight, you make them watch a quiet, quiet place part two. There is no better love between boy and brother, boy and sister, sister and brother. They love each other. I need to learn sign language for all kind of reasons right now because it may come a time where I just can't talk and I need to be able to sign some stuff to somebody. Your blood pressure, the hair might grow out the back. If you bald in the middle of your head, a quiet place part two gonna cause hair to grow out your body. Quiet place part two made me get stuck in the middle of my yard. I was... <gasps>